I'm Paul Peter Coyote, coming to you from Crestone, Colorado. Allow your heart to move you. Great things can be accomplished, even when you're a whacked out, stoned up hippie freak. So beautiful. I just started learning how to look into someone's eyes. And it was always a hard thing for me to do, but thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I love my life, I love my life, I love my life, I love my life. Screw what society tells you. Sorry. <laughs> this wonders of life that awaits you to explore all the magic and it's unbelievable. The colors and the smells and oh my god. It gets hard to distinguish. I know it sounds a little crazy, but it's absolutely true. It gets hard to distinguish the difference between where your legs and where your feet ends and where the board starts. You become this one unit. That's the amazing thing, is you feel totally connected. If we become disconnected from the natural world, we lose something magical, something so precious. We lose part of what it means to be human. We protect what we love. You gotta grab the bull by the horns. <laughs> and that's about what it's like sometimes if you lived a life like mine. But you just gotta just claim it. It's yours. Just hundreds of souls united in play. Mama? What? I love you. I love you too. I love you more. <laughs>
and living and experience that in the mountains. That's where you find the most peace. Mountains and the desert valleys too. Do some exploration there when you can. But be careful. Be wise. Don't take chances with your life. If you feel that something's too hazardous for you to be doing, don't do it. <laughs> That's the lessons of mountain living. Love you all. Greetings once again from Crestone, Colorado, and may I say, Aloha. Share